Thursday, October 7th, 1999. A clock begins to tick down at the Daimler Chrysler Technology Center in Auburn Hills, Michigan. As it does, Ray Evernham is already back working. Just eight days earlier, Evernham walked away from the job that made him famous as crew chief for three-time NASCAR champion Jeff Gordon. The weekend after at Martinsville, all eyes are on his replacement, Brian Weitzel. Separated by 42 hundredths of a second, just one more lap around this half mile at Martinsville, and Jeff Gordon still maintains the lead as they go halfway down the backstretch. Traffic will not be a factor in this one. Here is Gordon off the corner, but Earnhardt is right behind him. No, it's Jeff Gordon winning the Napa Auto Care 500 at Martinsville. Everham's departure did not end the dynasty. We are perhaps seeing the beginning of another reign here as Brian Weitzel leads his driver, Jeff Gordon, to victory in their first togetherness. While Jeff Gordon wins his third grandfather clock, the digital clock, the one counting down 500 days, remains Everham's singular focus. It's the countdown to the birth of a new team that will spearhead the return of Dodge to the NASCAR Winston Cup Series a moment with the potential to change the direction of the sport in an instant. It is the countdown to February 18th, 2001.